Good afternoon and thank you for being here with us. Uh, overview of the hydrogen sector status and potential. We were all scattered in different countries and trying to promote hydrogen as really a vector of energy for the world. And we realized that we had to somehow join forces. And we decided to create the Hydrogen Council. The initiative of having an Hydrogen Council, it uh, gave us together the first comprehensive vision of the potential of hydrogen. Being involved with the Hydrogen Council is a fantastic opportunity to help spread the word about hydrogen and to show the unity within the industry at large. We wanted to gather key large industry players so that the world understands that hydrogen is a silent but massive revolution. Uh, hydrogen is actually a highly versatile product. It's a source of clean heat, can be burnt and then it's clean. It's a source of power, uh, it can feed uh, the chemical industry or the refining industry as an example. And on top of that, it's an excellent way to store energy. I think that's a very important missing element in the energy system today. We're in the midst of an energy transition right now. The world is changing. It's important to support sustainable solutions because we've got a lot of challenges in front of us. We have the challenge of climate change and moving towards hydrogen is a fantastic step towards solving a number of those related issues. You're doing something which is good for the environment and which is sustainable and also which is huge in terms of technology, growth, uh, investment, revenues, profit for companies. All that is aligned with hydrogen, so that's why it's so exciting. It is a fantastic opportunity for sustainable growth on a global scale in many sectors. So we need to convince now, I would say, governments to put in place some policies. Well, the next step is to talk to the governments and to the authorities to set policies that will shape the future of any energy transition. Our long-term goal is to make hydrogen as a reliable, uh, profitable source of energy for the world. Developing a revolution requires to scale up and to develop traction with different communities. So we build the industry, we are building now the financial circle, next step will be the policy circle. When we've got those three communities, then you can start to build the right financial incentives so that financial players move in and that you can bring scale because you've got leverage with financial investors. The Hydrogen Council is getting ready for the next phase, scaling up. We think that after such a meeting there will be a much higher interest in hydrogen for the energy transition.